Aries, hi. All right, let's get into your reading. Peek at your person. All right, your person's overall energy, starting off with rest and rejuvenate, the waiting game, harmony. Uh, patience and planning, firm foundation. So Aries, I'm feeling like your person, maybe you guys took a break or had a separation. Um, definitely some kind of distance between the two of you right now. I feel like your person is maybe kind of waiting it out, maybe waiting to hear from you. Um, I'm hearing that song by uh, Gracie Abrams, I Miss You, I'm Sorry. So I feel like this person's really missing you right now. Um, and really wanting to get back together and work things out. Maybe they went on a little search or soul searching or tried dating other people. I'm hearing that song by you two. Uh, I still haven't found what I'm looking for. So <sighs> they're coming on back. I feel it. I just feel it, Aries. All right, uh, Aries, I'm going to start with your person's uh, current energy, current situation to see where they're at. Uh, if you're feeling the vibe and want to be part of the tribe, hit that subscribe button. Also, like, hit the like button and comment below if you, if you want. <laughs> I botched that, but okay. Alrighty then. Uh, Aries, so um, energies can be flip-flopped and reversed. So when I say your person, it can actually be your energy. So feel free to reverse the energies. All right, let's see what's going on with Aries person. They're feeling left out in the cold, left hanging, abandoned. Trying to move things into calmer waters. They are feeling single, solo, or independent. I feel like they're really feeling lonely right now. Uh, here's that world. So again, there could be distance um, physically, mentally, emotionally. Um, take that how it resonates. They do want victory and success here with you. Or they're, I mean, I could take it as like their ego is hurt too as well. All right, they're moving slow though. They are trying to be methodical here with how they return or how they reach out to you. They're definitely thinking about you, being nostalgic, maybe looking at old pictures or thinking about old memories here. All right, planting seeds. So this one wants to come out, yeah, reconciliation. Planting seeds to reconcile, reignite this flame. Wow, two of cups. I feel like maybe this person finally sees the truth. What's the truth? That you're the one that makes them happy. So let's see what, what the blockages are. What happened? What went wrong here? Was this person not giving you enough love or showing you enough emotion? Were they really shut down? Or just feeling, maybe you felt they weren't ready. There could have been a water sign, a Cancer Scorpio Pisces that got in the way. Or you could be dealing with a water sign. So it's like they want to move things into calmer waters. But it, it couldn't move for some reason. Why? Why? Okay, now we got Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So an Earth sign. Could have been a, a motherly figure. Queen of Wands, that's you, Aries. Okay, now we got King of Wands. Okay, there's a lot of people showing up here. Could be family, could be friends, could be the energies between the two of you. I usually take those as people, though, when they're court cards in a general reading. Um, they did create some kind of a burden here. So again, we have Leo, we have you, uh, we have Capricorn and Cancer. Because it's general, it could be a fire sign, water sign, earth sign. It's funny because everything they want up here is, is a blockage. Like wanting that victory and success. Wanting to move things into calmer waters. But it's being blocked. Lying, sneaking, cheating, stealing, manipulating. So is this person being sneaky? Wouldn't take a leap of faith. And now somebody's blocked. <laughs> somebody's blocked or they just didn't have that epiphany or aha moment or awakening and understanding what this connection really is. There could have been a lot of uh, conflict, arguments going on. All right, let's see. How does this person feel about you, Aries? How do they feel about you? Empress energy. All right. So they see you as a loving, caring, nurturing, um, 
grounded, abundant, fertile, male or female, it doesn't matter. Um, just very loving, caring, and nurturing energy. For some of you, you could have children with this person. Some of you, no, I, I'm just throwing it out there. Um, abandoned, left out in the cold again. So they feel like you abandoned them. And it wasn't fair. Something wasn't balanced and you walked away. <laughs> oh boy. So you walked away from them. Maybe you felt you had to. Yeah. Backstab, betrayal, painful ending. Closing out the cycle. There Again, there could have been distance. Um, but I felt like you, Aries, chose to walk away from this. It could have been backstab, betrayal, or some kind of a painful ending. And you decided to call it quits and peace out of there. What else do they feel? That's why they're waiting. They feel like maybe you're done, done. You don't want to move forward with them. You could have met an earth sign and started moving forward with a, a Taurus. Confused. I have Aquarius showing up here too. Capricorn again. There's a lot of people showing up in this. They do love you, Aries. They do. I feel like they want a new beginning in love here with you. Now we have Scorpio showing up and a decision. So do you have somebody else and this person feels like maybe you chose somebody else and now you have a decision to make? They also could have had somebody else too. Maybe you walked away and broke up and started dating somebody new. All right. This could be someone from the past past recent past to general reading <laughs> all right you guys take what resonates juggling so they feel you were juggling and also this is their perspective it may not be the truth it's their truth okay you saw something observe something or found something out about this person and they know it and they know that it changed your perspective of them i feel like the way they feel about you a little bit there's like a hint of like projecting like they did something to you you found out and now they're kind of like well you did this you did this like i kind of feel like it's being projected back at you even if you didn't do anything, this is, again, their their perception, right? So let's see. What are their next action steps? What are they going to do? Next action steps. So stress, anxiety, sleepless nights. Oh, yeah, they messed up. They know they messed up because the truth came out. All right. So trying to change, transform, ending for a new beginning. Feeling stuck. Why are they feeling stuck? House, home, commitment, leveling up. They don't want to be breadcrumbing or give to two. Did they get stuck in a commitment? Somebody's in a commitment here now. Or with somebody else or moved in with somebody else. Taurus is showing up again. Communication. So earth energy. What is this person? Next actions. Change in perspective. They have regret, sadness, loss, regret, remorse, the hermit. Maybe they had a dark night of the soul or some kind of awakening or doing some reflecting. And now realizing you are their wish fulfillment. You are their empress to the emperor or vice versa. You're their divine counterpart is how they're feeling. Yep, look, now they want 10 of pentacles with you, long-term commitment, loyalty, family dynamic, and the sun, happiness. They're trying to manifest you back. You all know my take on manifesting somebody back. You can't unless they're vibrationally matching you. <laughs> 
you can you can manifest them back by manipulation or whatever, but it's not it's going to be a karmic cycle because you're not vibrationally matched. Um, they are trying, they are trying, hoping, wishing, praying. What are you going to do, Aries? What is Aries going to do here? You may have moved on with an air sign or started talking to an air sign. Yeah, your wall's up now. They may have texted you or tried to reach out to you, or maybe you're observing, watching them on social media just to see what they're up to, kind of keeping tabs. Um, you found out a truth here. Some, someone was being sneaky. What is Aries going to do? You're taking a leap of faith, but I don't think it's with this person. For some of you. Some of you, you might. You might. It's a general reading, you guys. You do have a choice in love. Somebody has a wish fulfillment here. A double wish fulfillment. Rebuilding. With Earth sign. Creating a burden. What's happening here? Did you move on? Now you're with somebody new and this person's trying to come back and now you're kind of all like, I don't know what to do for some of you. You're sad. You do want to talk to them. You're. I know. I know. You're going to come at me. I know. You don't want to talk to them. You don't want to hear from them. Some of you do. We've been over this. <laughs> um, you, Aries, I feel are kind of stuck. Do I forgive them? Do I work this out with them? Do I give them another chance? Do I continue to move forward? I feel like you either have an air sign or an earth sign coming towards you or that you've already started to date or talk to. And you felt like you were starting to kind of go down like the right path. It felt right. And then bam, this person came back. Now you don't know what to do. You're kind of holding back. So what, what should Aries do with this person? Should Aries forgive this person? They're trying to change their ways. They are trying to make a change. They did have an awakening. They did realize what they lost. I have you here, Aries. You are confused. You are confused. But I have you with a stable new beginning and commitment. House home commitment. So I feel like the majority of you, you are maybe going to at least entertain listening to this person, maybe trying to give them a second chance. Some of you aren't. Most of you are. I feel like it's it's looking that way. All right. Messages for Aries. Messages for Aries. Grass is greener. Jealousy, better option, unhappy, you deserve better. So you do have another option here. Maybe two. <laughs> Fear, afraid, uneasy, suspicion, scared, hidden motive, conceal, lying, math. So it's again, it's can you trust this person? Yeah, they're trying to change, but are they going to long term? Or is it just temporary because they want to get you back? You know, that's one of the things you're going to have to use your, your intuition on. Toxic relationship. Fighting, codependent, misunderstanding, trigger, addiction. Okay, this just took another turn. Toxic attachment, drugs, alcohol, obsession. That's why they're projecting. Because they can't, they can't 
own up to what they've done. They can't accept that they screwed this up because they do love you. They do care about you. They do want this. And they did screw it up. But instead of them taking the responsibility, they're projecting and saying, well, you did, you did, you did. And not I did. And I'm sorry. You know, I feel like deep down they do know, but on the surface, they want to blame Unfortunately. Any other messages? Divine timing. Yeah, the waiting game. Be patient while things are unfolding. This connection is worth the wait. So be optimistic. Keep in mind that you create your reality. You can't attract love with a negative mindset. Gratitude. Uh, you need to be grateful for the love already present in your life to attract more of it. <laughs> so all right let's get some letters could be first middle last name initials could spell a name could spell a word of significance place it where you see fit um i'm seeing a c d r e j p g h m n b z so a c d r e j g p h m b n z all right, numbers could be birthday, anniversary, number of days, weeks, months, years, and age, and angel number. By the way, angel numbers up top, I have 44. What do we have here? We have 3, 5, 6, and 12. So it could be 35, 36, 53, 56, 63, 65, 12. 12 could also equal 3, so 3 and 3, so 33. Uh, we have March, May, June, and December. All right, zodiac signs could be their sun sign, strong placements in their charts. Something could happen during that season, like Aries season, for instance. Sorry if that was loud. I have double Cancer, Aries, Sagittarius, and Pisces. So Cancer, Pisces, Aries, Sagittarius. Again, I saw heavy earth coming through. Could be any sign, you guys. Again, it's a general reading. Um, all right, Aries, that is what I have for you. Love and light. Take care.